Child, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I am back. Yes, I know it's been a while, but I'm back. You guys, I've been having a lot going on lately, as always. As all of us, we all have so much going on. I have been um, getting some stuff coming in, and it's been about three weeks, so it's been a while. So this is definitely a collective haul. Um, I have some Bath & Body Works stuff that I want to show you guys. Um, it's some Easter stuff, a couple of uh, the new candles that came out. Um, not a ton of stuff or sure, it's been so long since I've ordered this stuff. <laughs> I know I did have to get a replacement because I opened one of my boxes and they had sent me some stuff that I didn't order. So I had to call and get my, the stuff that I actually did order, you know, sent to me. So like I said, I'm back. Um, sorry for the wait, you guys, but here I am. So hope you guys are doing well. I'm just going to go ahead and get started and open my boxes. I do have some candles I have I know I ordered a candle holder so I'm excited about that so we're just gonna go ahead and get started and you guys this stuff like I order some stuff like for Valentine's Day that's how long this stuff has been sitting here um, I believe the Valentine's Day stuff went on sale like right after Valentine's Day so that's when I went ahead and picked up some stuff I always wait for the stuff to go on sale or on clearance and then I'll go ahead and pick up stuff you know that I need and or that I want and then I'll just you know use it for next year so that's what I did so a couple of things you'll see that will be like part of the Valentine collection so you guys that's how long I've been like that's how long this stuff has been sitting here it's been sitting here for a while I got really sick at one point I was down for like a week because I was really sick and then right after I got well I went on vacation so I just been having stuff going on like I said that's why I haven't been able to get in front of the camera so I do want to apologize for that but I am still here honey I'm not going anywhere honey um I told myself you're getting in front of that camera today like stop playing like get your behind up and go <laughs> and make some content for your supporters so um I'm here you guys so thank you for just um being here for me for supporting me and just you know being there for me when I'm here and even when I'm not here thank you guys I appreciate it all um, so I do I'm gonna open a candle that I have and this is actually a candle that I did not order you guys I did not order this candle it was sent to me and so I did not order wait did I order this one Oh, I did order this one. I'm sorry. <laughs> so this is a candle that um, I've been... So just giving you a backstory on this candle, you guys. I saw this candle um, show up on the Bath & Body Works site. Now, it was a coincidence. The name of this candle is called Sedona Sandstone. And I'm just going to put it there for you guys to see. It's a beautiful candle. I love it. I love the tribal type of um, um, labeling on it. And it is wrap around. So it wraps all the way around. Very beautiful. Love the neutral colors on it. So when I saw this candle on the website, I was like, oh my God, I'm going to Sedona. That's where I was. That's where we went for vacation. Like we had already planned months back that we were going to go to Sedona for my vacation. So I got time off work and I said, we're going to Sedona. So I saw this candle and I was like, oh my God, you know, I'm going to use this candle when I go on vacation and this will be perfect for like a picture in Sedona with the red rock and everything. And you guys, this candle smells really nice. The notes on it is patchouli and rosewood. So when I got this candle, let me tell y'all what I did. I messed up so bad because I got this candle and I saw that it said patchouli and rosewood under the bottom. And I was like, wait a minute, that's not my candle. That's not the candle that I ordered. So you guys, I did not take this candle with me because I didn't know that the notes on it was patchouli and rosewood. And I'm, I didn't know that the Sedona, that the 
this actual candle was the Sedona candle that I was waiting for. I had ordered this candle ahead of time because I was like, okay, I'm gonna order it. That way I, I have plenty of time to receive my candle and I can take it on vacation with us. You guys, I got the candle and I was like, this is not it, you know? I, I thought I got the wrong candle and the whole time it was the right candle. I just didn't open the candle to look at the name on the front. So don't be me, you guys. <laughs> don't be me and I love this candle I actually smelled this candle it smells really nice it has like a smokiness to it it almost smells like uh, the fireside candle um, <clears throat> you know that real smoky um, note that it has it, it almost smells like the fireside candle um, that comes out in like the winter time like around Christmas time I believe it comes out that's what this smells like, but it, but I love the packaging on it, the neutral color. It's so pretty. So you guys, um, I highly recommend this candle. And like I said, don't be like me <laughs> when you get your candle and you look at the bottom and you're like, that's not what I ordered. Cause this is exactly what I ordered. And I actually called the people, uh, I actually called member services and I was like, I didn't get my candle. I got some other candle. And afterwards I actually opened the, candle well I just opened the candle up and it's actually the right candle so I feel so bad about that but I end up so now I guess I have two because they sent me a replacement which I feel so bad because if I would have just opened it so now I have two you guys look at this but you know what what's funny is when these candles went on sale I was like okay I'm gonna purchase one and then I realized I was like I love this candle so much I want to purchase another one and I wanted to have a backup so I actually have a backup now I have two of them so that's crazy though that's like I don't know how that happened I need to pay more attention I guess like that's completely my fault but Bath and Body Works if their customer service is just a one it's just like you can call them and say hey I didn't receive my stuff or my stuff came broken and they will immediately like replace your stuff now another item that didn't come and I was like, I didn't receive my wallflower because I thought I had the wrong candle and then I also didn't have my wallflower. I actually ordered this wallflower and it wasn't in my box. Let me tell you what they gave me instead. Instead they sent me this one and I didn't order this one. This one's just like a plain black, you know, not saying anything is wrong with it, but I definitely did not order this and this was put in my box. This one was missing. This is a Valentine candle holder. So I did, I was I was legit with this one because I knew that I had ordered this and it wasn't in my box. So they did send me a replacement, which is, which I'm happy about. So I only made one mistake, not two. <laughs> okay, so uh, let me show you guys this one. And like I said, these, y'all, I was ordering this stuff back in February. So that just tells you how Oh, this stuff has been sitting here how long and that's how busy I've been and that's just how crazy life has been for me and I just haven't gotten in front of the camera and I need to work on that so this one is the one that I ordered this one is the um, Valentine it's like an envelope and it has hearts coming out of it and this is the wallflower and I actually got this free I used a reward to get this um, the total price is $14.95. Totally got it free. It's super cute. Um, I saw it. I was like, I want it. And I ordered it. And I was like, man, I didn't get it. I was like, when I order or when I call customer service, they're definitely going to tell me they were sold out. Because that happens a lot. Like, if you don't get an item and you call and you're like, I didn't get my item a lot of times they, they'll be sold out. It's already sold out and they're like, we're sorry, we just have to refund you your money. But this one was still in stock, so I was happy about that, you guys. This is another wallflower. This wallflower is really pretty. I thought it was really cute. Um, just, the, just the design of it goes with my aesthetic in my kitchen. Uh, my kitchen is made of like wood. You know, I have wooden cabinets. I have the whole cabin aesthetic in my house because I live in the mountains so I thought this one would be great for my kitchen it's really cute it's just like a little lantern super cute not too over the top just a nice 
And this can be used year round. I can use this year round and not have to change it out. Um, this one is actually a night light, so it does light up at night. And this one was $16.95. I believe I used a reward for this one also. I usually don't pay for my wallflowers unless they're like Halloween wallflowers and they like go on sale or something. But like for my, my wallflowers, I usually just use rewards and redeem my rewards for, for wallflowers. Okay, my next item is, this is a um, aromatherapy bath and body Bath and Body Works um, Aromatherapy and it's called Calm Haven. And this is Lavender and Iris. I've never smelled this scent before. I did see it online and I do, I did need some more of my aromatherapy bath wash. So a lot of times I put this in my bath. When I'm taking baths, um, I'll use this for like bubble bath because this is definitely a body wash and a foam bath. So you can use it for either way. You can use it for either body wash or for a bath. And that's definitely what I use these for. I like to put these in my bath and they make it, you get the aromatherapy going on and uh, it creates nice foaming bubbles. So this one's called Calm Haven. And like I said, I've never smelled this one. It smells really nice. What are the notes on it? Let's see. It does smell nice. The notes is lavender. I knew I smelled lavender in it. So the notes is lavender and iris extract to relax and reflect. So got that. Um, this was a little box inside of my box. Let's see what this is. Just bear with me when I'm really not too sure about what I ordered okay this is a Easter item <clears throat> and I saw this on the website and I was like oh my god that's so cute I have to have that and she's so pretty I've been going I've been going crazy with like rabbits and there's a there's a ton of um they put glitter on everything you guys notice that like they put glitter just there's like glitter falling everywhere. I'm just happy she's not broken. Because she is made of like, I don't know, porcelain or something. Or clay, I'm not sure. But this is a candle topper. And look how pretty she is, you guys. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. And I love candle toppers. Like, I'm just super extra like that. Like, when it comes to... <laughs> stuff like this like I just like melt for it and I end up picking it up and they're really affordable I might have um I think I did pay for this I was gonna say I might have used the reward but I think I did pay for this and she was $8.95 and look how cute she is and she has the magnet on the bottom and you just put her on top of your candle and like I said I'm real extra about things like this a lot of people you know are like oh my god I don't you know that's too much it's not too much for me <laughs> Look how cute she is. Oh my God. And you just put her on top of your candle, you guys. Yeah, so I've been going rabbit crazy. I've been buying tons of rabbits to add to my collection because for Easter, I don't have much Easter decor. Like I noticed when I pulled out my spring and Easter decor, I didn't have any Easter decor. I just had a little bit of stuff that I ended up purchasing years ago, you know, on like 75% off, but I really didn't have much so I was like let me see if I can pick up a couple more things this year to add to my Easter um, decor I believe this is my candle holder so I did get a 20% off or 25% off coupon you guys know how they're always dropping these coupons in our um, in our wallets you know on on the app you know trying to fish us in <laughs> try to fish us in to come in and purchase from them and honey it works for me because whenever I see like a 25% off I'm running to get like a candle holder or something because candle holders their candle holders are way expensive and you just you know nobody's gonna pay full price honey so if you're gonna give me a coupon I'll take it so this is another Easter item and I thought this candle holder was so pretty, you guys. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. 
and it was wrapped up really nice in a styrofoam mold so she didn't break at all which is awesome I applaud Bath and Body Works for doing so great so much better on you know protecting their items from getting broken and here she is here so she's just a bunny she's she has this really pretty pink uh, soft pink uh, holder up here and then it's like it's like a lily I'm not sure what this flower is I'm gonna call it a lily you guys correct me in the comments <laughs> if I'm wrong but she's like standing up and like smelling the flowers so beautiful you guys and they didn't put any um, glitter on this one which is really nice so it's just the all matte um, the little flowers are pearlized um, they're kind of like um, iridescent coated really pretty really pretty in the color it turns like pinks and blues and greens but this is a beautiful holder you guys and like I said I got this holder for 25% off then the um, the actual price was $39.95, so I got 25% off of this one. Great deal, you guys, and this is a beautiful um, Easter candle holder. And I'm gonna put her back here. I actually wanna put her back here, uh, put this new holder. This is my candle that I'm burning today. This is the Cactus Blossom. I love this candle, very beautiful pink jar so we're gonna move this one to the side and we're gonna put this one here she's so pretty and she fits in perfect with all the all the Easter decor beautiful it's so pretty back there because I was like I need a nice pretty Easter candle holder to go for my background back here and she she fits perfect Guys, hold on because there's another box inside of this box so we're gonna let's open this one and see what's in here and I'm trying to remember what it is because I'm really not sure but I'm not sure this one looks like another candle holder and this styrofoam look at this I cannot like how do you get this out without getting it <laughs> oh my god I cannot get this out what is wrong oh my goodness They sent me two of these candle holders. Look it, it's, how did I get two? I didn't order two. And see, I didn't even open this box, so I had no idea I had two. I have two now. I need to go in and see if they charge me for this one. <laughs> because if they charge me for two, I'm gonna return one of them. I ended up with two, you guys, that's crazy. Child, I don't know what happened. I don't I know I called for replacement and I didn't I didn't recall for another candle holder. It was just for the the wallflower and this Sedona candle. I didn't tell them that I didn't get my candle holder, so I don't know how I ended up with two. Okay, but anyway, <laughs> we're gonna keep going. Cause I got let me take this stuff out because I got too many. This box is too big. Okay, so my next item is this Happy Easter Daffodil and Daydreams. This is a hand soap, foaming hand soap. Um, I'm a foaming hand soap girl, I say it in all my videos. Um, this is the only type of soap that I pick up and that I love. Um, this one is so pretty, you guys. Look at the, look at the packaging, like what? It's the flowers in the spring packaging for me, you guys. This is so pretty. Look at that. And it has a pretty bunny on it. So the notes on this one is whipped marshmallow, pastel clouds, and sweet daffodil. So this one has a marshmallow note. Y'all know we love marshmallow notes, right? So let's see. Oh, this smells really nice. Oh, it smells so good. 
And I got soap on my... <laughs> Y'all, I got soap on my mouth. Um, this smells so pretty. I love it. And it's really light. It's not like a heavy scent at all. I do smell the daffodil, like the flower note, um, the floral note. And then um, I get a little bit of the marshmallow, like the sweetness. Um, I really love this and the packaging sold me like when I saw the happy Easter there's no way I could not have this on my bathroom sink like what so I do I did get that my next one is hip hop hooray this one's in like a blue packaging and it says cottontail cake pop so I was very interested when I saw this because the cottontail cake pop is what drew me in and I'm just gonna look at the notes, um, the package. What the heck? Look at this. Wait, first of all, look at this, the sticker. Look how they put the stick. They just slapped the sticker on girl. And then look at this. Look, what is this? Maybe that's why they sent me an extra <laughs> candle holder because they screwed up big time with my order this is like two stickers in one so it's two stickers overlapped and they just like did it like that y'all that's crazy okay anyway we're gonna keep going the notes is delicious cake butter rainbow sprinkles and fluffy buttercream so those notes really intrigued me when i when i read them online and i was like i gotta try this soap so um I, i'm i'm sure there was a sale and i bought them for like 2.95 or something Oh yeah, this smells really sweet. It smells like candy. This smells like candy, like almost like cotton candy or something. Cake batter. It, it This definitely smells sweet. And I'll just keep getting this damn soap on my mouth. <laughs> um, I'm trying to smell it. This definitely smells really sweet. Um. The packaging is really cute um, if you get one that's actually, you know, labeled the way it should. Because this one, like I said, um, luckily I have like Easter candle holders. I can just put them in the candle holder. Luckily this is on the back. Nobody will really see it, you know. Um, but this one is a really sweet one. Um, I actually think I like this one better than that one. I definitely like this one because this one is just so much more lighter and airier. Um, I do like that one better. We have another aromatherapy item. This one is called Rainfall Retreat. And this is, it has like, it's it's crazy because I'm like looking at it like, what is that? It has like um, texture to it. So I guess they were trying to mimic like rainfall, like rain. And if you look at it, I don't know if you can see it, you can see the texturing on it. <laughs> You can see the texture on it, that's so cool. It kind of caught me off guard because I didn't know uh, the packaging was like that. And then, so this one says, a rejuvenating aroma of fresh eucalyptus, warm cedar wood, and dewy cucumber. I love cucumber notes, especially in the summertime. Excuse my voice, you guys, it's a little raspy. Like I said, I was sick a while back and I still have my like lingering symptoms. This smells really nice, I like this. Oh, it smells so fresh and the the um you you really get the cucumber and the eucalyptus is really light so i don't like a heavy eucalyptus um i like eucalyptus but not as much as i used to um it just gets too overpowering for me sometimes but this one is nice the cucumber is just a nice cool note to it that just brings it down to that real it it really gives like a spa like a retreat definitely the the name fits it it says rainfall retreat and this is definitely what it's given it's given like a spa when you walk into a spa you know how you walk in a spa and you want and like you're trying to get a massage or something and they have all these nice um nice smelling aromatherapy this is nice. I'm definitely going to buy some more of these. I need a few more of these. So as soon as we get an aromatherapy cell, I'm on it. This is Rainfall Retreat. Definitely going to buy. 
another one of those. And then I did get another happy birthday. Um, and this is just a mini travel spray. Um, I did get one of these, I think maybe a year or two ago. And I basically used it up because I love the scent. It's like a cake. It's a vanilla buttercream um, note. Really love this. And then, um, you know, my birthday comes, my birthday's in June. So whenever my birthday comes up, I like to use this. And it's just really cute. It just says happy birthday. And I love the scent. Like I said, I, I used up the other one, so got another one of those. And then this is another cute little item that I picked up. This is actually a pocket back holder, and it's just a little chick, and he has on bunny ears. And he's so cute. He's so soft and fluffy. His fur feels so luxurious and soft. He just feels like a soft, fluffy bunny rabbit. But it's a chick. <laughs> And with the little bunny ears, I thought this was so adorable. And look at his feet. His feet is like, like he's jumping around. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. So I did pick him up. I think I used a reward for him. This one was $10.95. Um, I'm sure I used a reward for him. Okay, I have one more box. Um, it's a couple of candles. Let's see. Um, this is, I believe, the oldest order. So this was stuff that I ordered around Valentine's Day. And it smells nice. Something in here smells nice. I don't know what it is. But we're going to see. Let's see. Okay, so first we're going to go with... Wait, what's in this box first? Let's see. Okay, so this is a candle holder. This was actually a Valentine collection candle holder. And it's just the, and I had stopped buying these. I use, I had so many of these candle holders, like I stopped buying them. But something, this one intrigued me and I just had to pick it up because it had all the cherries. The cherries are really cute. And you can put a nice, like, um, like a white candle or something, you know, that'll really just bring out the cherries that'll make them pop. I just thought this was really cute. And I did use a reward for this. I remember using a reward for this because I I stopped buying these because I had so many, but I definitely wanted to get that one. Okay. Um, I have a couple of travel items. I believe they had a sale. It was buy three, get one free or something like that. So I bought a few travel items. Um, this is when they came out with the Sweetheart Cherry scent. Um, I have a ton of Bath and Body Work body sprays, body lotions, body creams, body washes, <laughs> everything. So I just started buying travel sizes. That way I won't have an abundance of uh, an overabundance because I already have an abundance of Bath and Body Work uh, body care. So I just had to take it down a notch. I just had to say, okay, that, that's it. We're not doing no more of this. So <laughs> I just started buying the little guys and I can go through these little guys so much more faster than the big ones. Like the big ones will last me for a lifetime. These, I'll go through these and be done and feel good about it and not just have you know, just an overstock of too much stuff. So I did want to try this one out. So I did get the Sweetheart Cherry. I just want to show you guys this one one more time. This is the travel size. I also got the Japanese Cherry Blossom. I love this scent and I used it years ago when I was young. And, um, you know, it's... I smelled it recently. I don't know who, I believe my daughter had it and she like sprayed it. I was with her one day and she sprayed it. And I was like, what is that? And she was like, it's Japanese cherry. I was like, oh my God, I forgot about that one. It smells so good. So I definitely wanted to, um, you know, just bring it back into my, um, into my senses. So, and it's actually become really popular. A lot of people like this scent. I remember it smells really fresh. I love it. And I forgot, like I said, it does have like a heavy, um, like in the beginning, it does have like a heavy alcohol, but once it dries down, it's a really nice scent. And like I said, I just wanted the little small one 
and it smells really pretty actually i love it i forgot how good this smelled i used to rock this years ago honey um japanese cherry blossom is is she's been that girl like for a long time now for i want to say oh my daughter is 20 my daughter is almost 30 years old and i was wearing this before she was born or when she was small so that's how long japanese cherry blossom has been around and she's still that girl like people are still purchasing her she's still around that's when you know it's a good scent when they hold on to it and it just lingers around forever okay so on top of that i did get the japanese cherry blossom body wash this one looks a little sticky but we did get this one i was supposed to take this with me on my vacation but I ended up just taking some other stuff I had. I was like, oh, I'll just keep whatever, you know. And I wanted to show you guys, so I had a bunch of stuff I could take. It was, it was, it was nothing. And then I did get the Luminous Diamond Shimmer Mist. Um, I never smelled this this scent. Um, I might have sniffed it in the stores, but I never purchased it. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna buy the little tiny bottle of the shimmer mist. And that's all I need. And so that's what I did. And I love Shimmer Mist, you guys. I'm always purchasing the Shimmer Mist. So it's nothing for me, you know, to have this. And I've heard so many good things about this um, scent. So, you know, it does smell really nice. It smells like a perfume. Oh, it does smell really nice. It smells like a perfume, actually. So... I'm sure this will be nice to have like in the body here, but I'm just going to stick to this because like I said, I have too much stuff. So here's another soap that I got. This one is called Flower Child. And this is in this pretty orange see-through bottle. And I was like, I have to have that. It's so pretty. The packaging for me is what sold me. And on top of that, I have the Flower Child fl um, candle. And that candle smells so beautiful, you guys. I got that candle last year and I totally remember how good it smelled. And I have to pull it out because it's about that time. It's springtime. And like I said, this one smells so nice. Um, if it smells like the candle, it smells beautiful. It does, it smells really pretty. And like I said, this one is the flower child. And the notes, let's see if we can find the notes. The notes is white. Narcissus, Narcissus, uh, I'm not sure, I probably butchered that, but cashmere, musk, and sweet cedar wood. <laughs> so like I said, this was really pretty and the oranges was so me, the orange is my favorite color. Okay, so I have another candle and this candle is hummingbird tea cake. Um, I was really curious about this one, I saw it online. First of all, I love hummingbirds. Like hummingbirds are my favorite. And then the tea cake is what kind of like drew me in. There's a copper lid, really pretty. It has like a plaid wraparound um, packaging. Oh, it smells really nice. Um, it smells like, it does smell like cake. Um, and the notes is pineapple, cake batter, cinnamon, spice, and toasted pecans. So I think that's what kind of drew me in, the toasted pecans because I love a good nutty note. Um, I'm a real nutty girl. Like when it comes to like nutty type, garmon type of scents, um, I'm here for it. So I love it and definitely happy with that one. And then I have one more to show you guys. And this one is the almond croissant. And see, this is another one that intrigued me. It's almond croissant. And I love a good almond croissant. And just the fact of having like a candle that smells like an almond croissant is just giving me life. Like, and it smells, it does smell like an almond croissant. So the note is pretty much on point. It doesn't smell too heavy, so I like this one also. And the notes is toasted almond, vanilla glaze, and flaky croissant. So this is, that's crazy because it does smell like an almond croissant, like the ones that Starbucks used to have and they discontinued and I was like super disappointed about it. <laughs> 
um, that's what this one smells like so this is the packaging here just nice almost like Victorian packaging and then you got the almond croissant there and then it's like a copper lid also very nice candle well, you guys that is it for that haul I'm definitely gonna figure out what's going on with these two uh, candle holders I have two and I didn't order two I only ordered one so I'm gonna definitely see what's up with that um, I might have to return it if I was charged for it if not I'm just gonna keep it um, but everything else I'm really happy with and um, I'm happy to be back in front of the camera you guys so thank you for watching I'll be back with more content and I'll see you later hey